Can you finally use Grammarly in Google Docs? One of my favorite plugins is Grammarly. Until now, you have had to grab your content that you wrote in Google Docs, copy it over and paste it, and it's been really frustrating. Just yesterday, I was meeting with a client and we were doing some work on my laptop and I got this pop-up that Grammarly can be now edited in Google Docs and I about freaked out with my client right next to me. She's like, what, what? And I said, no big deal. It's just a tool that I love. Uh, had an update and it's awesome. I'm Josh, preferablelife.com. This channel is all about helping you get to your preferable life a little more every day. And internet marketing is a big part of that because that's how you grow and scale anything you want to do. If you're into that kind of thing, hit subscribe because I want to help you get there. Today, Grammarly and Google Docs. What's it doing? Where are we at? And what I think is coming along, along in the future. Here's a doc that we uh, are writing. And what we got is this little Grammarly pop-up thing. Super cool. It's telling me I have 14 grammar errors. So typically in the Grammarly uh, tool, you would click this guy and it would pop up. But right now, the pop-up editor is not available. No big deal. So you, here, here, here's, where, here's what it's doing. It does the exact same things, kind of like whenever you use it and you're editing in some web form or whatever. So you got your recommendation, just click and change, done, boom, red, click and change, click and change. I, I look at those a little cleaner, but I'm trying to make this cheap and fast for you. So super cool. Used to what you had to do is you had to grab all this stuff. You had to throw it over here. You had to let it do its thing. Then whenever you paste it back, all of your headers are gone. All of your everything's get gone. You just have a plain text paste and it was extremely frustrating, but very worthwhile because Grammarly rocks. Significant, significant upgrades. It is not doing any of these uh, advanced features right now. It's just doing the critical ones at this time. But step number one, I would assume is to get these guys done. And that means that this is gonna happen at a later date and that'll be even way cooler. Uh, a couple other things that it's doing is whenever you, so there's another one, uh, dump a large doc or you open up a large doc. This doc has 2,200 words. Um, it has this little kind of warning or whatever. Uh, doc looks a little long. Do you want Grammarly to check it? You just click the yes, check it button and then it, it does its thing and it takes its time and all that kind of stuff. So it's a... Uh, rocking my face off that Grammarly is finally in Google Docs. Google Docs on, see, one of my team guys is working on this right now. Anonymous Crow. Hey, Anonymous Crow. <laughs> what Google Docs sharing with your team and all that kind of stuff is critical. And it's been encumbersome to have Grammarly not in Google Docs, but Preferable life is on its way because Grammarly is now in Google Docs stage one and I'm sure multiple stages to come. Hope this helped you out on breaking the news that Grammarly is now in Google Docs. I'll put a link to Grammarly in the description. If you're not using it yet, you're missing out. I am Josh at preferablelife.com. We will catch you on the next one and have an awesome day using Grammarly in your Google Docs. Check you later.